Hello, my name is Uno and stop waving. My name is Uno and I'm gonna help you beat Nergigante Arch Tempered. Yes, I said that backwards. I'm also gonna do it not with the overpowered set. I won't be using the Draken armor. I'm not gonna be using the uh, Nergigante Gamma armor, but the other uh, Master's Touch set that you can use or get from uh hopefully you got the tickets for uh the gamma armor because that's what i'm using i should probably show the decorations but yeah i'm gonna show you that even without the highest and best build you can still beat uh arch tempered nergigante as long as you're careful and you pay attention to this video so let's jump into it so before or while I'm getting my prep on, I'm going to answer some quick questions real quick. Uh, one, yes, I ate for attack. Uh, two, yeah, you did see fortify. Just in case I do end up dying, it'll pretty much buff me. So dying is, well, actually could be a good thing. Uh, three or four, I don't know what number I was on. If you notice, I'm not using the divine slasher. And I'm also not using, I don't know, that one gold sword that every, like, cool cool boy uses. Um, because I'm trying to make this as user-friendly as possible. No crit boost gems. The only kind of sort of rare gem that I have. Okay, I didn't expect the double core, but alright. But yeah, no crit boost gems. The only gem that might be kind of hard to come by is the uh, tenderizer gem. So what we're gonna do? Make sure you drop the boulders on you, on them. Like before you leave this area, make sure that the freaking can I hit him? Can I? Thank you. Make sure you drop the boulders on him. Gay Perry. Dang it. Ooh, that was close. That was close. But yeah, make sure you drop both the boulders on them. And once I drop this other boulder, I'm gonna show you. The next thing you need to do and or learn to do while you fight him, because this one is most important. Ooh. Fade back, get back in. Wait. Which is actually the next thing you need to learn how to do. When you swing, sometimes you might want to wait to see what he does. So that way, You'll determine where whether do you need a period or not. Because if you wait, you'll you can see what he's about to do. But in the first phase, he's not really too crazy. He doesn't do the quick dive that probably everyone I know I did not just miss that. That I know that everyone hates by now at this point. Okay. Why do you why are you doing this move so much? Being ballsy. Yep! And that's what happens when you're ballsy. Oh, go roll away from that. That's what happens when you're ballsy. You uh, you get punished. That was both a B trying to... Really? That was both... <clears throat> that was both me trying to show you an example and... What happens if you overextend yourself? Because he will punish you. Also, please uh, have your sword for health recovery. That, that's another thing. But uh, like I was trying to say, in this form, he doesn't really do too, too much, honestly. Also, oh, oh, if you are going to try to parry it, make sure you don't parry it near a wall, because that hitbox stays out forever. And while you'll parry it, you'll still get hit with the damage, and that sucks. Here we go. Wait. Okay. Go. Whoa. Okay, next thing you need to learn how to do. When he's attacking you, or you're up near him, especially after this phase now, because now is where he starts to get ready to just just do the quick bomb. Also, one of the monsters is going to fight and make sure that turf war happens, because that'll help you too. But this move. That. If you're, if you're fighting him and you're up close, poke him, wait, see what he does. If he doesn't move, 
Go ahead and parry it. Normally, if you just poke, you'll have enough time to parry it because if you do this move, that move comes out so slow that by the time you're doing this, you're going to get hit. So usually I spam that to up, back to a poke, back to a up slash if I'm scared. I, I'll just keep doing that because it's, it's quick. You have time to parry if you need to. Also, I just realized I didn't use any of this. <laughs> I didn't use any of that. So, on the phase two, I'm going to get ready and buff myself with all of this. And then, you make sure you go Super Saiyan. Because now, with that up, just, just wild out on him. Because it doesn't matter. Gay parry. Roar. Yep, couldn't roll off that. I was still in my uh, sheathing animation. Okay, I can be bold now because I have Super Saiyan. Yeah, that move. That that move is probably the bane of everyone's existence, I'm sure. So while you're... Yeah, just, just go off. Just go off. Go stupid. Ah, go crazy. Ah, go... What? <laughs> oh, God. That, that, okay, I, I actually wasn't expecting that to be so... See? Here it. Here we go. Bold. Here we go. Also, if somehow by some miracle you end up knocking a horn off or his thorns are toppling him. Ooh. Get him. Ooh, kill him. Let me stop. <laughs> Let me shut up. Okay, so the Oh, I just turned dark black. And my Super Saiyan's about to be up. And he's about to do the quick bomb because all of his thorns are black. So it's coming up pretty soon. I don't want to be a cool boy and try to parry it. So, roar. I'm just going to run. And dive out the way. And then now we're back in the, back in the neutral. I don't know if I should have did that. Okay, okay. Sometimes rolling through his legs works. Sometimes. Shoot! Oh my god, how did that pull that off? Also, you even sometimes. Ooh! <laughs> anyway, sometimes. That's why you poke. When did he even show up, bruv? <laughs> also, here, this would be a good time to sharpen. Let them fight it out. Good time to sharpen. Also, make sure you have some crystal bursts for later. I'll, I'll touch on that a little later. But anyway, all right. Ooh, I probably should have just dove. But since my sword was out, I was scared. And that's what. See, I didn't poke. That's what happens when you don't poke. Wow, he's going through these pretty quick. Anyway, that's what happens. When, when you don't poke, you, you get punished. Alright, so now he goes down into this area. You know, bring a cool drink like normal. Most people, I'm sure, knows this, so I'm not really saying anything different. But as you're coming down here, go ahead and pop your stuff. And now this time, put on your mantle. Put on your Rocksteady mantle. And by the time your Rocksteady Mantle is pretty much done, or so, and since you have the Tool Specialist from the uh, Lunasha Armor, I hate that move with a passion. I'm trying to tell you. Okay. Also, pretty soon you probably want to give him a mount. Just to get some free damage on him. Oh, God. Okay, I want to be bold and do that, but no. I, I'm gonna... I'm gonna just heal up a little bit with a regular potion. Even though I should have used the... Uh... Okay! I'm gonna die. Okay, so... Can you stop doing that move? Yeah, he... I don't know what's happening, but... Yeah, we're... I don't care if my mantle's up or not. I need to topple him over. He's 
He's controlling the flow and I don't like it. And I, I just need to slow this down and get a breather for a second. Because it... Woof. Alright, pretty soon... Leap. He might knock himself down. And it should be up right now. He should be done. Yup, go to the tail. Swing, swing, swing. Bop. Uh, those are black, so I'm just gonna go work on the tail. Because I can damage it. But yeah, so far, this, this is pretty much it. Just keep poking. Oh! I just realized another skill you should probably bring. As I as I pinged off him, I just I just remembered. Um <coughs> excuse me. If you have mind's eye and you can somehow fit it into a build, whether you don't want to do master's touch build, um bring that. Just in case, because if you ping, that is just another it's just another reason to make you open. Oof. Go off on a tail. Oof! I don't know how I'm dodging this well. Ow! Okay, stop with that! Hurry up and do the... Oh. oh my god! Hurry up and do the big roar! By the way, that tail will probably one-shot you. Watch out for that. Where's my... I know I have it. I don't have the jerky. Yeah, I do! Yeah, I do. Alright, so now I gotta sit here and... There we go. And we dive out the way. Nope, nope, nope. Don't don't parry that. That's the two hits. It's two hits. No, don't be deceived. Gay parry. Get out the way of that. He's gonna leap over here. Hit him on the arm once. Poke. Knew it! Cause he he famous for that. Alright, I'm gonna do a mounting attack just to weaken him for later didn't I don't know how that didn't hit me. Wow, he's our oh I don't know how he, he's I don't know how much damage I'm doing because I'm not really paying attention to the numbers and I'm trying to talk as much as possible. But um coming up soon, this is gonna be why you need the crystal burst, which I probably should have refilled on some of them but anyway so now super saiyan is back up so we snap into a slim gym i merely rock on any block and now we go into the super saiyan form we gotta say super saiyan form there we go even though he has black spikes so i probably should have waited yeah i definitely should have waited Yup, definitely should have waited. Okay, perfect. Alright. And of course, while you have Super Saiyan, you don't have to worry about the poking strategy that I told you about earlier. Okay, I forgot you, Trimmer. You are roaring a lot, my sir. Go off. Go stupid. Go crazy. Give me my red. Thank you. I am fine with that. I Right now, my confidence is at a thousand right now. Right now, until like this goes away, in which case, come on, don't move for a second. Thank you. Oh, shoot, we knocked them down. Okay, go stupid, go crazy. Okay, and that's done. Pop that, pop that off. And then in a little bit, I don't know what you're about to do. Ow! Oh, my baby Lanta! 
Um, where's my jerky? Where's my jerky? I should have put it as a default something on my wheel. Alright, we're gonna try to get lucky real quick. I don't know what he's about to do. Um, yup. Just dive out the way of that. I, I don't trust it. I just need to get get some time. If don't be don't be ballsy. If you think you don't need you don't have enough health to hit him or whatever, back up for a little bit. It's fine. Oh shoot, I'm at the period. If I try to put my sword away <laughs> if I try to put my sword away, yeah, I would have got hit with all of that. I've never been hit by the dive bomb. And I'd rather not start now also I don't know why but his roar is like severely weakened which, I, which is good all right back to the pokes poke poke all right so now he can go one of two places he can either go further into the lava or he can go back to where he started Yep, Roxanne Mantle is back. Okay, he did not go back to where he started, I think. No, I think he went even more into the lava. Which is, that's actually fine, because that volcano erupts, and that'll give you some extra damage, which is good. Uh, we're definitely, we're definitely gonna drink. Bop. And... Oh shoot, give me give me hold up. Wait, wait a minute. Okay. I'm think I don't know how weak he is right now, but just to be sure. Oh, he's gonna dive bomb. Yep. And the super dive bomb is coming soon. Like I Just back up. Just just back up. That's fine. Okay. All right. Yeah, just I, I don't know. I, I don't know how I'm dodging those those quick bombs. Ah! I think I'm just so scared. Nope. Okay. Um, I missed. No. Nope. He was gonna truck me. Gay Perry. Roar. Oh wait, I have, I have Rock City Mantle. What am I doing? See, I I make mistakes all the time. <laughs> like why why am I diving? What are you about to do? We're gonna parry that. I don't know what my fingers did, but I'm trying to tell you that my brain, my brain wanted me to parry it, but my fingers just did some just the whole other stuff. Wait. I'm gonna drink just just to be on the safe side. Like I'm trying not to die for y'all, cause I, I'm not trying to get embarrassed out of here. Oh, that yeah, he's getting a lot weaker. Quick bomb. Oh shoot. What a boy embarrassed. <laughs> okay, my bad. I didn't mean to taunt you. Nope, don't swing. Like, it's just times where it's like, I feel like if I swing, I wait until he does a move. That's a whole lot of recovery frames. And then that's when I swing. So, it's, whoa! <laughs> wait. Okay, now get up. It's just, it's just a lot of... Yup. This is why I need the Crystal Burst. Hit him so he doesn't go back to his uh, lair. Because when he goes back to his lair, he gets a Zenkai boost like he's a Saiyan on Dragon Ball Z. And you do not want to fight him there. <laughs> Like that episode of Pokemon when Ash is fighting Magmar in a volcano, you you don't you don't want to do that. <laughs> I I promise you. Yeah, let's roll out of the way of that. Normally I parry it, but I'm just trying to be safe. Gay parry. Poke. Ooh. Oh 
bold for being bold, boys. No! No! Actually, this is fine. This is fine. He's gonna he's only gonna go in the center. And I can restock up on my um my crystal burst. So that's fine. And if worst comes to worst, I do have some exploding barrels if I need to actually use them. Uh, also, can you come back this way? You snap it to one of these. Yeah, he, the, the boy getting tired. Yeah, okay. Alright. Okay! When did that even turn into a freaking uh, black spike? Yeah, the, the more tired he is, the less HP he has, the more likely he starts doing quick bombs and... Okay, see? 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 Shoot him. He's gonna re come back to the center. Nope. I don't got time for that. At this point, I'm just swinging and swinging and hitting. Just swinging and hitting and hoping for the best. Like the the temporal mantle is essentially when you go to the club, you got a few drinks in you. You don't have you you got all the confidence in the world, all the confidence in the world. You you got your drinks going, you feeling good. That's that is what the temporal mantle is. You shoot, nobody can't tell you nothing. You ain't matching. You don't give a fuck. You drunk. You don't care. That's the temporal temporal mantle. Okay, stop. Hurry up. Hurry up. Hurry up. Hurry up. Hurry up. Toby! Come on. Um. I didn't. Yup. I, I, that's what I was scared of. It just. It just wore off, too. That is exactly. Yup. Hurry up and get up because he's gonna do the fake jump thing. Or just boom! Rush you. Well. That sucked, but it doesn't really matter whether you beat them and not die. Fortify, bitch. The fact is, everyone wants that armor. And enough time has passed, so now I can just get me another one of these. The only bad thing is now he's probably like going closer and closer to his uh, main camp. So that kind of sucks. But in the meantime, uh, what am I doing? Restock all your stuff. And get ready to go back out there and fight them. Oh, I'm leaving all this in. If you thought I was going to cut, like, away, I'm not. Uh, he's he's not still down there. Let me, let me warp to this one. I don't think I'm going to catch him. I don't think I am. Oh, that sucks. I was doing good too, cause I know he's like he's he's living living on a thread right now. You sneeze on him, he's probably Papu be dead. Also, I just realized I forgot to tell you I'm using the uh, the cheer horn whatever palico where he does the horn and stuff. Yeah, he already ah, fuck. He already went. He already went. Alright, well, my strategy was supposed to be you're going to keep hitting him with the crystal burst every time he starts to leave. So that way he doesn't go to here. So now, I got to pray that I end this quickly. Because the more you fight over here, the more he just... Whoa. I also just realized that he's probably going to have black spikes all over. So... Hmm... Yeah, that's going to be annoying. Alright, well, I'm going to do one cheer and hope it's a attack buff. Crow! Play out, play out, play out attack buff. Or you can just uh, drink yourself silly and spinning in circles. Why are you still drinking? Why are you... Why are you still drink? Anyway, so like I was saying, um... So you place one barrel right where he's at. You place another barrel, maybe a little bit further away. 
and you shoot that first barrel so then when it blows up you get the extra bonus damage like that actually I didn't do it because the freaking shits hit the shits yeah this is uh, worst case scenario this is this thing's this didn't go how I wanted to he's supposed to die with the barrel but he didn't so now I have to deal with him just Oh, poke, up swipe, poke, roll out, roll out, what is he about to do, roll away, roll away, what are you about to do, what are you about to do, quick bomb, okay, okay, what are you about to do next, bow, I got time to swing, and a poke, wait, counter, roll, roll out the way, Wait, wait, well, I got time to swing, but he's probably going to quick bomb after that. Oh, that. I got time to... Okay. Ah! Swing once and poke. Up swipe. Yeah, I was like, I didn't know what he was about to do. But... Okay, what are you about to do? Quick bomb? What are you about to do? Roar? Oh, tail! Nope, 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 nope. That will want Bikaro. <laughs> what? That was not what I think that he's gonna do. And Temporal Mantle's back. So that's cool. What are you about to do? Now, now is the time. You have to be the most careful. Take your time if you need to. Don't swing yet. This is this is not a rush. This is not like Behemoth. We have to kill him in 30 minutes. Just take your time. Oh shoot! Quick bomb. Get up because he's gonna do the floaty thing. That. Put it away. Actually, that saved it. <laughs> okay. All right. He's doing too much! Okay, I got time. And we got time to pop this. Come at me! I probably should have did another mount on him, honestly. Got all the confidence. I got the drinks in my system. I got my drink in my two-step. What's up? Come on. Come on. Go down. I know you want to. Dang it. Come on. Again? This is the most I've seen you do the tail. Cause normally, normally he doesn't do the tail a lot. Yeah, as you see, if uh, you don't get the temporal battle, ha, <laughs> boy! <laughs> I don't know how I broke that. But... See, that's why you don't parry near the freaking uh, corner because he will. The damage will still hit you. Oh my god, I'm so glad you stayed up for that long. Come on, man. You should be like about to be about to be dead. Ooh. Perfect time. Why you You are a true monster hunter. I swear I didn't play him for that <laughs> to be the last hit. But that was cool that it was. <laughs> Oh man, Brandon, put it, future Brandon, put it in the bapu beep, you're dead. Mm, Cynthia, you're dead. You are dead. Bapu beep, bap, 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 bap. You're dead. Thank you. What was the wrong time? Like 24, 25, 28? <laughs> Doesn't matter. That's how you do it. There's a lot of, there's a lot of, a lot of poking. 
A lot of up swipes. A lot of rolls where you think it's coming. Don't run out of them and do that after like the first phase. Unless you're fully confident that he just did a move that's going to have a lot of recovery frames for him to, you know. And once again, I'm going to show you the build. Look, at I didn't even have four attack. And you know, you know, everybody's all about that. You gotta have four, level four or not, or, you know. But this, this is the build. Make sure you have that, all uh, three vitality. I do think, uh, tool specialist helps. And fortify definitely helps. Excuse me. Sorry, I just had a big lunch. Anyway, hopefully that helped you. And thank you for watching. Sorry, this is probably a bit of a long video, but what are you gonna do? Actually, hold up. Let's, let's see what I got. What was that gem? That one gem that I got? Is that fortify? Dragon. Okay. Yeah, I'm in the video now. Thank you for watching. <laughs>